Hi friends, thanks for watching. Today we are doing another clean with me video. So if you guys love my clean with me videos, definitely subscribe to my channel so you'll see more videos. With that said, let's get started. So I am organizing the boys yogurt pouches and juice area and then we got these apple cider um, bottles as gifts so I put that in storage because we rarely drink apple cider unless it's like a special occasion and then here I am in the kitchen putting clean dishes away and you guys told me that after the dishes are done open up the dishwasher let it air out and it helps you know dry the dishes and that works so well so thank you so much for telling me about it because we don't have one that like automatically dries the dishes uh, but you guys are awesome. Thank you for your suggestion. TMI, don't judge your friend, okay? But I just got back from the gym this day and it was the morning, like an early morning gym session and I was still wearing like my gym clothes and I was like, you know what? I am not that pooped. I want to clean the house. So that's why I filmed it and that's why I'm in gym clothes. But I promise you I took a shower after I did all my cleaning. <laughs> and then over here, these are the dirty dishes that I need to put in the dishwasher. So I went ahead and I did that. By the way, my um, gym outfit, they're both Fabletics. The tank top I've had for years, but the pants I just recently got a few months ago. They're really comfy. If you guys want to check out Fabletics, I will include my affiliate link which will give me credit to shop the site. So if you guys are interested, check it out. If not, you can just search fabletics.com, no worries at all. So that grass drying rack over there, I usually just put like Jakey's cups to like dry it out and also Tupperware, so I'm putting that away. This is kind of like the Liam Jacob section. I put Tupperware as well as their plates, their cups, sippy cups and little bowls, all those like plastic type of um, bowls for them there and here I am scrubbing the sink it's one of my favorite things to do I don't know why it's just a weird thing of mine but I like just seeing the sink shine and oh my gosh you guys someone told me to try the Mrs. Myers honeysuckle scent I never even knew that scent existed because I've been obsessed with geranium for years I finally decided to try the honeysuckle scent Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. So thank you to all you friends who mentioned honeysuckle because that smell is everything. And I bought it on the Grove site. So here, you know that green drying rack? I decided to put it through the dishwasher. It's dishwasher safe. And sometimes you gotta clean it out just because you know, you're know, you drying things and then it gets all moldy. And, and yeah, you just gotta do that. So I wiped down the counter with the Mrs. Meyers geranium scent. But once I run out of geranium, you better believe I am gonna be all over honeysuckle because I already ordered it. So here, I'm just cleaning off everything, wiping everything down with the geranium scent spray. I ran out of that bamboo spray, but some of you guys told me that I should check out the lime, the lime method spray. It's called like lime and sea salt. I'm getting that next, you guys. I'm obsessed with cleaning products, if you can tell. Like I always want to know about the new stuff and like the different scents and things like that. So I move everything around so that I can really get into the corner and wipe everything down. And then over here, I'm just gonna wipe down the table. Usually, I like to use a little bit of orange glow if we're like having company over, but this is kind of like a click, like a quick clean with me. It's not like a, like a deep cleaning one, so this is just like whatever spray I have, that's what I'm gonna use. So this is the playroom. We honestly haven't done much with this room, so it's just like an empty space where the kids play, but I do want to decorate it one day and like get a rug and things like that. that I think it would be cute. And then over here, I'm just moving everything around so I can dust this area. Oh my gosh, you guys, seven years married. Did you guys see that picture? That was our wedding day. I can't believe it. So here is the ottoman in the living room. And inside the ottoman, I have like these containers from the container store and I organize the toys. I know it seems a little crazy to do that and it takes some time, but I promise you it's totally worth it because if, it, if I didn't do that, all the toys would just be in the ottoman and it wouldn't be organized. So if they wanted to play with Legos, they'd have to search for every single Lego piece. This way, it's just so organized. Like if they want to play with cars, they can play with cars. Or magnet tiles, they can play with magnet tiles. But certain things I, I just don't put in containers like stuffed animals, dinosaurs, and things like that. Every now and then it gets a little disorganized, but most of the time it's pretty organized. And my boys, I just feel like it helps their play. I don't know. It just I feel like it does. And here I'm just wiping everything down with the geranium scent spray. And I'm just organizing the books underneath and also puzzles. This is 
Our, my house is just like a kid zone. <laughs> so it's not like fancy schmancy, bougie woogie. It's just, let me tidy everything up. And this house is definitely a kid's house. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, so yeah, we didn't buy a carpet, or I mean a rug for this part of the living room quite yet. I'm just scared. Mr. Bob's gonna pee on it and then we're gonna waste money. You know what I mean? So here I am dusting Justin's family piano, this family heirloom. This thing gets dusty. I swear dark wood attracts dust. And here I'm just um, wiping down this mirrored table. I'm kind of thinking about switching that to like a regular white table. I'm not into that mirrored look anymore. I don't know. Um, wiping down that area as well. And then, ooh, what was that? <laughs> I was trying to um, stabilize the camera. So here I'm wiping down the refrigerator and Sometimes it gets so sticky that I decided to just like wash it in the sink. Like it's so cool that it, it's detachable. Like I love that. If I had time, like a few hours, I would like remove all of that and put that through the dishwasher. But you know, just washing it with soap and water works really well. And I just continue to do the same thing over and over again. Removed everything from the containers. There was some chocolate in that. So I definitely had to wash that with soap and water, dry that up, put it back and put everything in its place. I definitely need to do an organized deep clean session with the fridge. But for now, I'm having a great time knowing that I actually cleaned the little, you know, shelves over there. And I went ahead and removed everything like as far as like strollers and ride on toys in the outdoor kitchen backyard. And I'm just wiping down the outdoor kitchen with soap and water. And um, this outdoor kitchen, like just because it's outdoors and it's really windy, it gets dusty. Like I will dust it one day and the next day it's already dusty. That's just how it is and where I live in the Bay Area, it's just windy. So here I am just drying, I mean wiping everything down with soap and water and also the chairs because they get really dusty and like wouldn't you hate it if you had like company over they're wearing like white shorts and then they have like it looks dusty so that is my cleaning video for the day friends thank you so very much for watching i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time and remember to subscribe bye